Hey everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude and I am here to review the Spongebob episode House Fancy requested by Marlene Levers. So House Fancy is about when Squidward sees his arch nemesis Squillian Fancy's son having his own TV show where Squillian just shows his very fancy home. Squidward of course getting jealous and frustrated about it. So he calls Nicholas Withers the guy in in charge of the TV show to come over to his house and Squitter wants to make his house look more fancy and better than Squilliam's home but then of course you have this yellow idiot popping in and just ruining things for Squidward. So how's fancy? How is this episode? It's enjoyable. It's not great or anything. I wouldn't even say it's technically a good episode. I know there's some people that really hate House Fancy. Believe me, it's completely understandable why House Fancy has so much hate. There were good laughs in this episode. I can't deny that. And execution here, it's very, very poor. It's not that great. And it just felt lazy in terms of the pacing. The pacing really felt nothing special. It didn't really add anything to make this episode better. SpongeBob really did get on my nerves in this episode. And there is over the top crude humor in this episode that is most certainly not needed. I just described all of my flaws with House Fancy. The good moments definitely were that there were some laughs. The whole plot with this, with the whole house fancy thing was really enjoyable. I enjoyed seeing Squilliam's home. That I thought that was the best part of the episode, actually. Well, other than the laughs I got, the best, my favorite part of this episode was definitely seeing Squilliam's home. Uh, all the fanciness in there. I just thought it was very entertaining. It was very enjoyable. And, I'm not gonna lie, I was actually impressed with how Squilliam's house looked. I mean, like, damn. It's good to see Squilliam here again because this is Squilliam's first appearance in the newer episodes of Spongebob. His last appearance was in Squilliam Returns. And we haven't seen Squilliam ever since. I'm glad to see Squilliam again. I don't like how Spongebob sometimes adds toilet humor. It's like... Really, do we need that? There was this scene where Patrick, out of nowhere, he just barges into Squid's restroom, uses it, and we hear Patrick take a massive dump in there, which is unnecessary, disgusting, and unoriginal for me. But then the funny part after that unnecessary moment comes when the toilet is actually talking. Like, it was just so stupid, and I was busting out laughing, and it kind of kinda made up for Patrick <laughs> taking a dump in Squirt's restroom. Just please, writers of Spongebob, if you are somehow watching this, I highly doubt they are though, don't add toilet humor in Spongebob. It's just not very original. The toilet talking was funny. The whole Patrick taking a dump in Squirt's restroom. No. And there's this disturbing scene with the toenail, Squidward's toenail getting scraped off his foot. That was also very unnecessary. The whole Spongebob stalking Squidward in the beginning episode, that was unnecessary as well. The episode does have problems. Overall, it's, a, it's an okay episode. It's an enjoyable episode. It helps you get through the time. Not an episode I could really rewatch. Really, I can only rewatch this episode if I get bored and there's nothing else on television. House Fancy, not a good episode, but not a terrible episode for me. I definitely understand the hate for this episode. I'll give House Fancy a 6.5 out of 10. I can't quite reach it a 7 just because it's technically not a good episode. But I think a 6.5 out of 10 is definitely a fair score for this episode. Subscribe to my channel, comment your opinion on the Spongebob episode, like and share this video, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, I am 22 Tiger Dude. don't forget that I will always have TAGA POWER!